All right, looks like it's um, now it's moving up between 451.0, 0.1, 0 0.2, so it looks like it's fairly stable now. Let's put it at 451.1. 451.1. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is pull in the next one. This will be the yellow one. The yellow one is 220 microfarads. So again, the negative is off to the right. Let's just put it in that little slat. They're like little slats, like you're, you know how, you, how a dog goes in and out of a house? And you just stick them in, just like that. Now again, this one, let's see, this one may not take us long. The other one didn't take that long to stabilize, so we just sit and wait a little bit to see. So that last one uh, was supposed to be 470, and you can see it got pretty close. All right, 238.4, oh, 238.3, oh, okay. Let's put 238.3 for that one, 238.3. Again, it's going in between three and four or so. Uh, and again, 238.3, that's actually fairly close to 220. It's within tolerance. One of the questions they're gonna be asked is, is it within tolerance? Oh, I forgot to show you the tolerance. So for the yellow one, uh, the tolerance, if it doesn't say it, then you, it's going to be plus or minus 20. And this does not say the tolerance of it. So plus or minus 20 is fine for that one. See, it's within plus or minus 20. This one, let's see if we can read if there's a tolerance on here. Some of the manufacturers will put it on and some of them don't. Uh, this does not look like it has any tolerance either. Okay, this just tells you the temperature range, uh, minus 40 to 85. So that doesn't tell you the tolerance, 20%. This one, however, does. This is the Philip one. I mentioned this one before. This is a 330 microfarad, and the tolerance is between minus 10% to plus 50%. Minus 10% to plus 50 so again, let's put this in and measure the 330. Oh, got an auto range. The problem is when it, I didn't realize I had an auto range. It takes a little while. Well, it's not so bad. It actually settled down pretty quickly. Okay, 395.2. So is that above, is that 50% above 330, which obviously it is, so... All right, 395.2. So have those values in the next experiment. We're going to put all three of them together and see.